In this video, we'll show you how to set up, operate, and maintain some of the high-quality machines in our lineup of NSS carpet backs. At NSS, we pledge to do everything we can to make sure your new carpet back gives you dependable service year in and year out. We'll cover each machine one at a time. Although you may be using only one of these machines, we encourage you to watch the entire video because you will pick up ideas and information that will help you with any vacuuming task. First, let's look at two specific areas that apply to all NSS backs, safety precautions and care of filter backs. Be sure to read the operation manual closely for complete operating and maintenance instructions and for additional safety warnings. Never let anyone operate the machine who has not been trained. Never operate the machine outdoors, with wet hands, or in standing water, and always store indoors. Always plug the machine into a grounded electrical outlet of correct voltage to avoid electrical shock. With any machine, the electrical cord takes quite a beating during everyday use. The best way to protect your electrical cord and plug is to always unplug it at the socket, not by pulling on the cord. Every time you use the machine, check the power cord and plug for damage. Always replace a damaged cord to prevent possible injury. Another important part of any carpet bag is its filter bags. No matter which machine you're using, you'll get the best performance when you check and empty the filter bags on a regular basis. Use a paper filter bag for high indoor air quality. Check the paper bag every time you use your carpet bag. Replace paper bags when they're almost full. Now, let's take a look at each individual machine, starting with the Outlaw BV Backpack, a single motor unit designed to be worn like a backpack. To get the Outlaw BV ready for operation, first, attach the top cover onto the unit. The intake may be set up for either left-handed or right-handed use. Then, attach the vacuum hose by rocking it onto the intake until it's secure. Your Outlaw BV may also be equipped with the optional PEPA High Efficiency Particulate Air Filter Assembly, which attaches by simply snapping it onto the bottom of the unit. Attach the removable power cord, then thread the cord through the cord strain relief, and attach the strain relief to the machine. This helps prevent the cord from pulling out of the electrical socket while you work. When you put on the Outlaw BV, adjust the fit by pulling on the shoulder straps until they are firm and comfortable, and do the same with the waist belt. The Outlaw BV is available with a variety of options. One of these is a convenient on-belt switch. Another is a built-in outlet to attach a motorized 16-inch power wand. The power wand is just one of many accessories and tool kits that can be used with the Outlaw BV including carpet tools, detail tools, and even a handy tool tote, which attaches to the operator's belt for convenient access. You can use these attachments for many applications, including ceiling vents, lighting fixtures, shelves, blinds, upholstery, and office partitions. The Outlaw BV has a cloth filter bag. We also recommend that you use the optional paper filter bag for added filtration and high indoor air quality. There's also a foam filter on top of the vac motor, plus a removable foam exhaust filter on the bottom. Check the paper bag every time you use the machine. Replace the paper bag when it's almost full. Once a week, check the foam filters. If they are dirty, remove them, wash under running water, and allow them to air dry. If you are using the optional HEPA filter, check it regularly about once a week. The HEPA filter cannot be cleaned it must be replaced when it is visibly dirty or obstructed. For more troubleshooting and maintenance information, check your operations manual. For wide area carpet vacuuming, the Pacer 30 can't be beat. 30 inches across, this is the smart choice for reception halls, meeting rooms, hallways, and other large carpeted areas. The Pacer 30 uses multiple motors, two for suction and one for brush rotation for greater performance and longer life. To set up the machine once it's removed from its packaging, just unfold the handle to the operating position, 
and tighten the knobs on the handle until they are secure. Then open the lid Unfold the cloth bag and put it over the intake. We recommend that you also use the optional micro-lined paper filter bag. Just fit it inside the cloth bag like this and you're ready to begin operation. The controls are very simple. Just squeeze either side of the dead man handle to activate the vacuum and brush motors. If the brush motor or vac motor becomes overloaded, a circuit breaker on the handle will pop up. This will stop the machine. Allow the Pacer 30 to cool for a minute while you check the bag for fullness. Or the brush for obstructions. Then push the circuit breaker back in to reset. Where most upright vacuums have a knob to adjust for a different carpet pile height, the Pacer 30 has a foot lever adjustment on either side to raise and lower the brush. For short pile carpet, push the nose down for better pickup. For deeper pile carpet, raise the nose up. In spite of its size, this machine is easy to maneuver. And because of its construction, it's so quiet that you can operate at any time without disturbing those around you. The Pacer 30 has four different types of filters. The standard cloth filter bag, the optional micro-lined paper filter bag, a filter over each back motor, and an exhaust filter at the rear of the machine. Also available is the Pacer 30 HEPA wide area vacuum with high efficiency particulate air filtration system for applications where high indoor air quality is critical. Every time you use the machine, check the power cord and plug for damage. Always replace a damaged cord to prevent possible injury. Paper bags should also be checked every time you use your carpet back. Replace paper bags when they are almost full. And check the brush drive belt and the brush for wear or damage. Remove any carpet fibers, hair, or debris. Make sure the vacuum shoe is not clogged or damaged. And at the end of the day, just fold up the Pacer 30 handle for easy, space-saving storage. Once a month, with both the Pacer 30 and the Outlaw BV, check the cloth filter bag. If it is dirty because you have not used a paper filter bag, or if a paper filter was broken, you will need to vacuum the pores of the cloth bag to maintain suction power. And every 500 operating hours, Check the carbon brushes in the vac motor or have the motor inspected by an authorized service center. For more troubleshooting and maintenance information, check your operations manual. At NSS, we design each machine with simplicity in mind. That's why NSS machines are easy to use, easy to maintain, and built to last. It's no wonder that we've built our reputation as the workhorse of the industry for over 80 years. And we're here to help when you need us. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, contact us at NSS World Manufacturing Headquarters. The National Super Service Company. More than just a company, a commitment.